Tonight, a Fresno High School band director is in jail after being arrested today. He's accused of having an inappropriate sexual relationship with a student. 38-year-old John Veloz Jr. was in his first year at the school, but he's now on administrative leave pending the outcome of the investigation. Action News anchor Corey James joins us live at the school tonight where police are hoping surveillance cameras will come in handy. Corey? That's right, Liz. Police say there may be surveillance footage that actually caught the student and teacher going into the classroom together. Now, authorities say they were informed about this all yesterday after the student's mom called them and told them her son had been molested on campus by his teacher. Two hours after school started at Fresno High School, band director John Velos Jr. walked out the doors in handcuffs. Police say the 38-year-old teacher was arrested Friday for having an inappropriate relationship with a 14-year-old boy. When we drop our kids off, we expect our kids to be protected at school. It's not good to hear. Authorities say the teacher and student had three sexual encounters in his office over the span of three weeks, all during school hours, something senior Jennifer Lucero never would have expected from the man who taught her piano. He was really... Um, nice. But Lucero tells Action News the design of the band room may have helped the alleged acts go unnoticed. The office has, um, it has a big glass window around, so you're able to see inside, but um, the band room is underneath the ground, so not really anybody could see that like what's going on underneath the, in the classroom. On LinkedIn, Velos has a long history of working with kids, including at the youth orchestras of Fresno. We stopped by the organization for comment, but no one was there. After reaching out by phone, I received this text from someone saying Velos has not been employed there since last year. We're in the process of trying to contact. Meantime, in a joint press conference with Fresno Unified, police chief Jerry Dyer said detectives believe there could potentially be additional victims, and he is encouraging them to come forward. Parents uh, do their due diligence, uh, make contact with their children who have been um, a student of Mr. Velos to make absolutely certain that uh, they too have not been victimized. And Velos is believed to have come into contact with about 200 students each day. He is in the Fresno County Jail tonight and faces five felony counts of sexual misconduct with the minor.